Hi everybody, happy Monday. Welcome to another edition of my weight loss story. I'm Conrad Bombardier. I'm glad you're here to join me today. I have two days of updates and a contest update as well. Uh, so number one, I hope that everybody had a great rest of the weekend. Um, I got to relax. I went to the gym on both my days um, and then kind of just unwind and relaxed and went to bed early last night to get that sleep. Um, and I know that I mentioned it a few times, sleep is so important. I mean, it's not only just important if you're on a weight loss journey, but also just for stress and anxiety. And there's so many great benefits and factors of making sure that you get your rest. Um, the same benefits is what exercise does. So I hope that you're planning or have been doing, or if you need help with what to look for or what to start, um, I can definitely give you advice, uh, at least with what worked for me, being able to listen to you, um, being able to maybe suggest some things that might work for you. So um, please don't hesitate to reach out, ask me some questions. I'm here to help you. Um, days 1003 and 1004 today. Um, today is my rest day. Uh, so that's been nice. Uh, I got some stuff done at home uh, to prepare for the boys coming over for Thanksgiving. Um, yesterday was a, still my, I'm doing a big arms program. It was a light arm day. Um, it was great. I took my time. I was able to do my weights, put myself in that zone. And I definitely, I, I, I could feel my shoulders still a little bit, but I can, today was I can definitely feel the soreness in my arms and that, uh, that feels good. It tells me that I had a good workout. Uh, I did well, I enjoyed it. And it's not all about heavy weights. It's about making sure that you have good form, that you're doing your exercise slowly, um, that you're really getting that tension on your muscles. And that's where you can tell that you've had a good workout and you're not rushing through it. You can A, hurt yourself, B, it just wouldn't be, um, I guess uh, it won't work as well for your muscles um, if you're not doing them right either. So um, take your time, enjoy it. Uh, I would say that as much as I can make sure that I'm just relaxing and not even worried about time, that's probably the best workouts that I do have, um, or at least wake up or plan ahead so that you give yourself enough time to do that. Um, weight yesterday, it was a 221.8. That was a third day in a row that I hadn't really moved. Uh, today it went up by 0.8 because I'm at 222.6 today. So it went up a little bit. I got another day and then my weigh in on Wednesday. I'm not too worried about my actual, uh, weight. I'm right in my, my range. So I'm good. Um, and in reality, I'm going to want to see it continuously just creeping up a little bit just because of muscle mass. So um, as long as I'm feeling good and confident, uh, then I'm good. I feel like I still have a little bit in kind of like my stomach area that I know has been smaller before. Um, so it's probably an area that I know um, I can concentrate on maybe more ab stuff or just continue to see it go down a little bit. But ultimately, uh, after losing 212 pounds, uh, I'm, I'm not going to lose any sleep over, let's say, um, 10 or whatever that ends up being. Who knows? Um, tomorrow, I believe, is chest and back. So uh, I'm excited for that. Uh, and I'm excited for this week for Thanksgiving. Um, it doesn't even... I, I'm not stressed out at all. I'm not bothered by it. I know there's a lot of things out there about the holidays and gaining weight. And, and I think... It's just having control and having self-control. And it's not, I don't think that anyone should look at it as a free pass to eat whatever you want. I mean, when you let Saturday afternoon, everybody's taking a nap from a food coma. It's not worth it for me. Uh, I, I enjoy my food. I enjoy eating my healthy food. I have a new meal plan from Adam, so I'm excited that this week, I'll be able to try some new things. Um, but those new things are going to be healthy. Are healthy. Um, I'm going to be eating the same times throughout the day. And I'm not going to be starving. 
um, which then I'm not going to be craving bad stuff. So uh, food is your fuel um, for your body. It's not meant to make you feel weighted, bloated, wear you down, make you tired. Um, it's just, it's eating the wrong kind of foods. So uh, I'm not saying don't have a treat. Uh, don't, you know, have a little something that maybe you wouldn't, but just keep it in a moderation and you'll be completely fine. So uh, with that, I did go check the website uh, on whatsyourstreet.com. Um, I did not have any additional subscriptions. So I know that a couple people shared it, um, but I didn't have subscriptions. So it doesn't look like we met all three criteria um, for the fat loss tax. So to keep things fair, uh, I can't really give that out uh, to anyone who didn't do all three. So with that, um, we're going to do this. We're going to do a giveaway for everyone that um, writes on the video today of A, two parts. A, what are you thankful for? Being prepared, obviously, for Thanksgiving. B, what is something that maybe you're going to look at doing or changing this year for Thanksgiving that's going to be a little bit healthier. Doesn't matter how what that is. It, it could be a goal that you have or something that you're going to do, whatever that is. A, what are you thankful for? B, what are you going to do different this year than last? Write that comment down in the video, anybody in the U.S. right now, and Across the board, you can share them, uh, but you just have to be in the U.S. to be able to be part of the contest. And we'll give away the fat loss tax. Everyone, have a great night. I will talk to you tomorrow before Thanksgiving, and I appreciate you all. Thank you for coming. Thank you for being here. Thank you for your support. Check out the website, whatsyourstreet.com. Uh, I'm excited, and uh, we're going to wait to see what's next. Have a great night. Be kind. Bye-bye.